the normalized difference salinity index or NDSI is a valuable tool in the field of remote sensing, particularly for monitoring and accessing the salinity levels in water bodies. NDSI is employed to estimate the salinity of water bodies based on the reflectance of specific wavelengths of light, which can provide official insights into environmental and ecological processes. The formula to calculate normalized difference salinity index is rate minus near infrared divided by rate plus near infrared. There are some other formulas for calculating NDSI, but I cite this formula from a research paper. This index is valued between minus 1 to plus 1. You can use Landsat or Sentinel-2 or resource set satellite images for this but those band numbers will change with respective satellites. To calculate normalized difference salinity index, I have added a Landsat 9 satellite image of Kutch region which is a salt basin. Here I have added red and near infrared bands of the satellite image. Now go to raster calculator and write the formula as red minus near infrared divided by red plus near infrared. Save the output and start the calculation process. After processing, NDSI values are calculated for the satellite image. Now change its color for better understanding. The saline areas have higher value which is near to 0.76 and shown as blue, where the less saline areas are in red color and near to minus 0.56. To calculate normalized difference salinity index in ArcMap at red and near infrared bands in ArcMap. For Landsat 9, these bands are band 4 and 5. Search raster calculator and write the formula as float red minus near infrared divided by float red plus near infrared. Rename the output and run the process. After processing, change the symbology. Here you can detect saline areas more effectively than QGIS. In this result, all hypersaline areas are in dark blue and low saline areas are in red. All these small dark blue fields are salt production fields. <laughs>